too. Let me explain to you now, okay? So the bank who owns the property. No, we own the property. It's a. It's a currently listen, not a clear listen, title. The title's not clear. Listen, get no. the, let me finish. I'm not interrupting you. So don't yeah, but you're saying things, things that aren't true. Do not interrupt me. You're trying to make statements as an I'm officer that aren't true. Man. Let me know when you're ready to listen. Okay, well, at least acknowledge the fact that you don't know whether the title's clear or not. Are you ready? Will you acknowledge that you do not know anything about the title? I can't acknowledge that, sir, because I've seen his paperwork. He showed me... There's no such thing as ownership until you have a clear title. The title's not clear. Go on, that's what we're here it's to clouded. That. It's not even your job to matter to investigate a civil matter. Well, are you ready to listen now why we approached the way we did? Sure. Okay. So he called us, okay, and he said that you came out with some rocks. No, he came out with the... Well, listen, don't interrupt. He said that you planned to throw the rocks at him. All he right. ripped down now, the gate and attacked me. Here, we don't know who you are. We don't know if you're going to do the same to us. No. So obviously we're going to take precaution. No, okay? I'm not. That's that's the reason why we approached the way we did. He's actually the one who aggressed me and physically like pushed me and ripped my gate down, threw signs over, attacked, screamed, and made me scared and run inside to call you guys. All right. So, well, do you have any ID or anything to verify who you are and or yeah. anything, some mail showing that you live here? Yeah, I do. All but right. I'm. it's my privacy that I'm... I that to myself, but I'll show you something. Check, look, can I see my DMV slip? Um, oh, yeah. Uh, that's all right. I'm sorry to have respond to you guys the way I am, but you guys scare the shit out of me like that. That's not fair. No, I know. I understand. I've already been terrified by this crazy Australian fucking New Zealander dude who's just, like, wickedly trying to, like, overstep his boundaries. That's called self-help eviction, and that's not even legal because we're not tenants. We are owners. Fucking bullshit. This is my paper. It's as much as you're getting out of me. Do you have an ID to match? Yeah. The ID? Yeah, hold on. Shit's in the mail, so. What's your first and last name, sir? Eric Seidenglanz. Christopher, Christopher Eric Seidenglanz. Is the guy here? It's kind of hard to see through this. Is the guy here as well? Because I don't want to have any reason. No, we don't have to wait on talk because we wanted to just talk to you first. There's no reason to violate my privacy. You know, this is a matter of... Your name's Eric? Hey, you don't have to say it out loud. You yell my name. Okay. Please. So you see they match. No, well, that's the, that's the issue. I can't really tell... Look, put it up again. Like, up here, I love them. It's just kind of hard to see. Chris, what? Chris, 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 Fourteen ten Ewing. Yeah. So here's my question because it says fourteen oh four on this. It's fourteen ten, fourteen oh four, and nineteen eighty six. Uh, oh, is it like a triplex? Yeah. Thing. All this. Yeah. This is um, just a unit. Okay. So fourteen ten Ewing, nineteen sixty eight Avon. That means the top and the bottom, the whole property. How long have you been staying here? Uh, I've been here over a year. Over a year? Yeah. I've been getting these kind of harassments. This is a second time I've been harassed like this. The first time was when I first moved in. Then the, the place went into foreclosure and we like fixed it at the last second and then we were able to get uh, uh, the title through uh, uh, a trustee uh, supporting us. Notice to preserve. Huh? Notice to preserve. Yeah, and we have a notice to preserve. Oh yeah, where is it? Sorry, one second, sir. Here you go. This is actually like the best thing I have to show you. Notice of I am at my right to be here. Notice of intent to preserve interest. And it's notarized right here. <laughs> Second page. Preserving interest. It preserves interest in the property, which means I have the right to this property color until color. otherwise, it's called color of title, until otherwise known. So did you own the property before it got foreclosed? Or? Um, I was a oh, tenant. Was renting it out or what? I was a tenant, and then I became. Uh, I had the option to buy it at the auction. Oh, okay. And uh, with that, we were able to re, re 
to basically take over the mortgage and uh, okay. All right. refinance. So, from where you're showing me now, uh, that shows a little bit more, right, than us initially knowing what was happening. Yeah, yeah, I understand. I just like the, the whole gun thing. You guys did that once before. Scary. Yeah. Just keep in mind, like, if he, if he comes, try not to, like, pick up blocks or anything like that. I, because that kind of lays he, he did that. He like, that's it. him addressing me. And I um, threatened to call the cops on him. And he's like, oh, yeah, I'm going to call the cops. And I was like, what? And then I ran down here and, like, closed the door and, like, basically just, like, Watched him damage like the signage and like try to rip the gate off. Okay. All right. Well, as of right now, we're gonna talk to him. I'm gonna get a supervisor out here just to kind of figure this whole situation out, and then once we kind of go from there, we'll give you another thing and we'll go from there. How does that sound? It sounds like it's a civil matter, and you guys have no business being involved in this, and that they need to deal with it. Yeah, I mean, and you're, you're most likely gonna be right. All right, but we just gotta just how we're hearing your side. We have to kind of hear all sides. And then kind of figure out what's the best solution. Okay? Yeah. When he was first at the gate, he's all, they barricaded the gate. We didn't barricade it. First of all, it's our house. Secondly, that's a garden fucking, yeah. pro this is a garden project for the LA Yard program. You know, LA Yard, it's a rebate. Yeah. You like to take up the turf. So we're in the middle of the, like a $12,000 like project to like get our rebate so our taxes can be paid for this year. And that's okay. like none of his damn business what our yard is. It's our yard. Okay. Well, let us go talk to him now. All right, and then we'll give you any updates if, if we have anything else, okay? Apologize the difficulty for you guys getting in, but there is actually a way no. in, but you see yourselves out the same way you got in, I guess. Just don't step on anything. Yeah, no, I know. It's a, it's a, little, it's a little muddy going up there. All right, sir. Thank you. Yeah. We're in the middle of making that gate repaired, by the way, because it felt... Yeah, well, it all came down in the storm, and so and the lock broke off with our key. So we okay. just that's why uh, we're making a new entrance right here, because uh, Harvey Shields, who owns this lot to my right, He's given us right to actually use the, the lot to grow a garden for the community. Okay. So uh, we're making our entrance over here where it's safer. Alright. Alright, Yeah, we are.